Welcome to Celebrating Act Two. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hi there, Sarah Surrett here with Get Positive Dog Training, and I'm going to help teach you how to teach your puppy his name. Pups don't speak English or Spanish or Japanese, and so it's all about teaching an association to that sound, the word that you use as their name. This cute puppy is just 12 weeks old and his name is Jet, but he doesn't really know his name all that much because it's only been a few weeks that he's had this sp special name. So we're gonna show you how to help build and reinforce your puppy's name so that when you call his attention, he's quick to listen. Check it out. The first step to teach your puppy how to respond to their name is pairing their name with something good. This little guy loves turkey meatballs. So we are working on pairing his name, a simple sound with something good so that we're increasing the likelihood that when he hears his name, he's more apt to giving us attention when we need it most, especially. So the first step is I want you to count out maybe 10 to 15 treats and put them in your hand. Okay, and you're just going to say your puppy's name. This guy's name again is Jet. How cute is that? And you're gonna feed a treat. And you're gonna do this rather quickly to keep your puppy in the game. So I'm gonna say his name. Now I want you to understand that while I do this, I'm not looking for any behavior. I'm not looking for Jet to look up at me or sit or come to me or do anything special other than hear the name means something good is coming. So I'm going to say Jet and give a treat. Jet, 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 Jet. You can see that he's starting to bring his head up a little bit when I say his name. Let's watch again. Jet! When you start to notice that they hear that name and begin to bring their head up, it means that they're ready for the next level. Jet! Jet! It's important to be patient after you say their name so you're not repeating their name several times without a reinforcer. Jet! If you don't see they're bringing up their head, you're gonna go back to just pairing the name, that sound, Jet, as a positive with those food rewards. Jet! Now you can use your puppy's daily food kibble or whatever you feed them as their meal to train. Jet! Jet, Jet. Once you have that head coming up, you're ready for the next level. So I'm gonna add my marker. A signal either with your mouth, like the word good, or a clicker sound to let him know what he's doing right. When I say his name, I want his head to come up in my direction and I will give him a click and he'll earn his reward. He's very distracted right now with the mat. Jet! I'm going to toss a treat down. Jet! Jet! So notice when I'm clicking, it's as his head comes up. Putting the treat away from you will help encourage movement back towards you. Jet! Good boy. Jet! Jet! We're not looking for speed right now, but as you practice, you'll notice that your puppy will bring their attention back faster. Jet! 
the timing of my click is as his head is turning up into my direction. Jet! Jet! Good boy. All done. You can also practice this exercise moving around in a small space. Let me get his attention. Here you go. A lot of crumbs. Jet! 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 He didn't, he said he didn't respond on that one. So you can practice moving to different spots to encourage movement back towards you. Jet! When he hears his name. Jet! 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 It's important that you wait until he finishes his treat before you call his name. Good boy. Jet! Got distracted on that one. If your puppy is still eating the treat or is distracted, you want to make sure that you don't repeat his name again and again and again. Let him finish the treat and think about choosing your attention on you. Jet! Good boy. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.